The fastest way to make a lot of money on TikTok shop with faceless videos is to recreate recent viral videos from TikTok shop. I didn't mean copy it precisely, but do take a very close look on the pacing, the timing, the content, and the words that appear on the screen. Then put your spin on it to make it your own. The odds of you hitting it big, doing this with one video are virtually zero. TikTok is a long game. It's a numbers game. You're gonna have to do this three times a day, seven days a week, probably for two or three months before you get any traction. But I can almost guarantee you if you do what I say in this video, you're gonna have a really good shot of making some solid money on TikTok shop, assuming the Supreme Court lets us keep it and all. The best way to find recent viral TikTok shop videos is with an app called Calo Data, which looks like this. Now it works for faceless or not faceless. I'm just gonna focus on faceless today because I'm gonna show you a, a super easy way. Calo Data is a paid app and there is a link for it in the description below, but it is so worth it if you're serious about making money with TikTok shop. Once you click on products, you're gonna see products that are trending. So you can use this page to choose products if you don't really have one in mind. We can sort by yesterday, the last seven days, 30 days are customized. So in the last seven days, click submit down here, we can see that these are the products that are trending. In fact, one of these happens to be the one we're gonna do right now, which is this ashwagandha, this goli ashwagandha stuff. I click on that and I can see a lot of really useful information. I can see that in the last, what is it, week, this has generated $426,000 in revenue. So people are definitely buying this. They've sold this many. Average unit price, live versus video revenue. You can do live streams on TikTok or just post videos. And if we scroll down here a little farther, we can click on video and ad. Now our goal is to find a video to be inspired by. So I'm gonna click on video and ad, and I can see all these videos. And I can see the ones that aren't faceless because I can see all their faces. Like there's one that's got some product, but that's a sales video. That sale's not going on now. Here's another one with a face. Oh, here's one that looks like it might be faceless. So let's watch this guy. Captcha. Now this is a really great video to recreate because it's just one shot with some text and some music. So we're gonna recreate this one and we're also gonna do it with a couple other products. We're gonna take this concept and do it with some other products just so I can show you. Now, because it is so simple, you could easily do this in the TikTok app or in CapCut Mobile. However, when you create these videos, you want to do everything in batch, do 10 videos, at a time, either very similar in how you're doing them or have a similar product. You wanna film them all at once, then you want to edit them all at once, then you want to upload them all at once. To edit in batch, it's gonna be much easier in CapCut Desktop, and eventually you may want to be making videos that have more than one shot, and that's just gonna be easier to use in desktop. I Frankly, I, I don't like using the mobile app. It's really hard to do anything very precision. So you're gonna make three videos, and all of the video elements I use in this video are linked in the description below, so go ahead and grab those right now so you can follow along. This first video is pretty tame. The other two are like, I'm pushing it a little bit, but you know, I'm trying to uh, learn not to care what people think and just kind of go for it. We've got the concept, we film the videos in batch. Now let's just quickly edit them in CapCut. We can edit all three of these videos in minutes doing what I show you here. Let's import the videos into CapCut Desktop and I have in my downloads folder, shot them tonight, all of them, bam. Now let's work on that first one. The reason this video did so well is because it created a little bit of intrigue. You're like seeing nothing at first and then it's revealed that it's the gummies and it asks kind of a funny question and the comments are pretty funny. You'll, you wanna go, go and read them. The sample video was about 11 seconds long. Felt a tiny bit long to me, so I'm just going to modify this a little bit. I'm going to start, let's see. I want it to be moving already, so I'm just going to play a little bit, position my playhead where I want to start the edit, and I'm going to type the letter, remember, the letter Q, so I can add an edit right here, delete this, and everything sucks over. So I hit Q, bam, it sucks over, it starts there, let's have a look at it, see if it feels good. It's got a little bit of sound going on down there, which is nice, and mine's a little bit different than his, and then boom, we reveal that. And I think done about there. That's only like nine seconds there. Let me give it two more frames, one, two, nine seconds. And if I want to trim this, get rid of this part here, I want to add an edit, cut it, and remove that all in one keystroke. What is it? Keystroke is W. Now we have all this, and we're, <laughs> we're halfway done. All I'm gonna do is add some text here and then some music within the TikTok app itself. So I'm gonna click on text and hit default text and I had some text that was similar to his, but slightly different based on what we're doing. His stuff was, you know, on, in some lookout, I guess. And we're gonna be in a forest here. So let's go ahead and zoom in a little bit here so the text 
we see goes all the way to the end. We also want the text to be, be positioned where we can read it the entire time and it doesn't block the product. So I'm just gonna drag this up a little bit here and we'll add our text in here. And I'm gonna make it, I'm gonna make the text pretty similar to his, looks like that. We'll use maybe a different font, how about Futura, so it's kind of readable. I don't even know what WYD means. I almost don't get this, but WYD is what you do. And we're gonna choose one of these looks for it so it's readable for us, bam and scale this down a little bit. And I think that looks pretty good. Maybe I'll just make it bold so it stands out a little bit easier to read. And bam, I think that's great. Now let's see, yeah. So what you do if your girl eating these behind a tree in the forest and then revealing, it's like behind a tree, what's going on? And then it's, it's a supplement. So it's just kind of funny, right? And bam, we're done with this one. All we have to do now is hit export and then we'll take care of the rest within TikTok. We're gonna edit the other two doing exactly the same thing and see how fast it is. So this one, just give it a name, Goalie Forest, choose a folder to put it in, go to my TikTok shop vids and I got some Goalie right, got a Goalie folder right here and I just hit open and I hit export and bam, it's done. Today I'm showing you some very basic things that CapCut can do, but it can do so much more. Eventually you're gonna wanna create videos that are more complicated than what we're doing today with more edits and stuff. And I made a course for total beginners where I teach you how to do everything that CapCut can do. It's called Edit with Trev and Master CapCut. If you're serious about growing with video, whether it's on YouTube, Instagram, or TikTok, if TikTok still even exists when you watch this video, um, you really wanna take out my course and it's gonna make your learning go so much more quickly. Just It's gonna save you just a ton of time. So check out, there's a link uh, in one of these places and in the description below, or just go right here too mastercapcut.com. And then we just do the next one. Now, here's why this batching gets easy because we already know about how long we want these to be. I already have the text font format ready to go. I can just add the next one down here, which is under media. And we're gonna do this one, which this is another viral product, Halara Leggings. My wife was gracious enough to let me use her for this. So this is a little bit different because we see what the product is the whole time. I would have done it different, but I'm just trying to make it work with this. Look how pretty those clouds are back there, by the way. I was trying to find a good starting point here. Let's see, there we go. So it moved a little bit there. So I wanna trim the front off that. I'll type the letter Q. Bam, and I don't want this audio, so I'm just going to click on it, and I can either drag this line straight down, the audio goes away, look, it goes up, goes down, don't need any of the audio. I can also get rid of it by clicking on audio and dragging the volume all the way down, so we have no audio, and let's see if this works. Yeah, that's that's not bad, let's make it the same duration as the other one, and to make this go away, what do I do? Position the playhead where I want it to go away, I'm going to add an edit here and delete all that by typing the letter W, boom. And then we're gonna change the uh, the text. And we're gonna make it readable because people tend to look right in the middle of the screen. So let me click on the text, drag it down to about here and then change the text. To change the text, I'm just gonna go up here and what you do, your girl wearing these in public. I don't know, this seems kind of funny. By the way, in the description of the other one it said, buy her more. So we're just going to do buy her more for probably all of them. And then bam, that's it. And then we just export this one. Export. And these are Halara leggings. And I'll put W-Y-D for what you do. And then we're going to put it in the Halara folder so I can find it. Oh, I was going to do this differently. I was going to do it by date. That's that's going to be easier. But for now, we'll just do Halara because it just makes a big mess like this. But let's put in the Halara folder right here and hit export. And it's almost instantly done. Bam. All right. Now let's just do one more of these. Now this Forgive me for this one. I think this is kind of funny too. So we're going to reveal at the very end. Oh, we need to get there. So we need it to get to there. So you can see these are uh, feminine balance gummies. I got no business making this video, but I, I can't help it. So I want to trim it up a little bit so you can see we're coming around the corner just to reveal. Boom, right around there. And I position my playhead there. I type the letter Q, slides it all over. And that's, we'll make that a little bit shorter. I'm just going to shorten up the text here, type letter W. And where do we want the text to go? Over here so it's readable the whole time. So I'm going to change this to what you do, your girl, eating these. <laughs> Sorry, I've had too much caffeine today. <laughs> and you know, you guys can see how these videos did. I'm really gonna post them, probably one today and a couple tomorrow. And by the time you, this video is up, they'll be up. And you can look at my uh, TikTok account. It's, uh, I think, Trevor Jones creator on TikTok as well. So you can follow me, I'll put a link down there as well. But I don't know, this seems kind of funny to me. What you do, your girl eating these in the bathroom, bam. And you know, I won't even tell you what they do because this is a family friendly channel, but it but it's good for women. So you should, you should buy them. And then we just do the same thing. We export this one. That's all there is. So, you know, I'm talking and showing you, but I could have done these all in like two minutes. Then we just give it a name, put it in the right place and export this as well. 
Ideally, you will have made about 10 videos and here they're all in different locations. In real life, you wanna make 10 videos in the same location about the same product. But I just wanted to give you a little bit of variety here. And doing it in desktop, you can just bust these out so fast. Once you've transferred the videos to your phone, you're gonna open TikTok shop right here in the very bottom. You're gonna hit the plus sign. Then you're going to select the video you want to do. We're just gonna do one of these. You can do the same thing for the other ones. Let's go ahead and use the leggings one because I like that one. Then we want to add a sound. That's what they call music or sound effects, whatever. But you need to add a commercial sound. Now, the reason we didn't do this in desktop is because you don't have access to the same music. For this stuff, you've got to use your phone. So all I do is I hit add sound at the top and I hit the magnifying glass. And then at the very top, you see it says sounds. We click on it and we choose commercial sounds. And then I'm gonna click on discover more sounds here at the top. And what I usually like to do is just use a viral trending pop song. So I can scroll down and see TikTok viral. And there's not a ton of songs. There's that many only, but let's go ahead and listen to a couple and see what we like. Boring. I mean, sometimes it works for certain things. So beautiful day, that kind of works. Now next we want to adjust the volume a little bit. So I'm just gonna click on this icon on the top right that looks like a sideways phone. And then I click on the track. And in this case, I'm not gonna lower the volume, I'm just showing you where it is. Normally I'm speaking in the video. And if you're speaking, you don't want the music to repeat, so you can lower the volume by just dragging the slider to the left. But we're gonna leave it right where it was just because there is no talking. So I'm just gonna hit the X and hit next, and we're ready to make this thing live. Now, what I do to make this thing simple is I just click on description and I dictate what I want it to say. If you catch your girl wearing these leggings in public, you need to buy her some more, exclamation point. These Halara leggings, these Halara leggings have side pockets, comma, tummy control, and butt lifting technology that is out of this world. Hashtag leggings, hashtag butt lifting, hashtag tummy control, hashtag best leggings. When you dictate it, it'll usually get things wrong like the product name, so you just jump in there and correct that. You do wanna add hashtags, though they don't matter as much as you think. What matters is creating a video that people are going to watch, that they're going to immediately engage with because your hook is so good or it's so interesting. TikTok knows what you're saying, they can see the words on the screen, so it, we'll figure out where to go, but hashtags do help a little bit. You're gonna get a ton of advice if you start watching TikTok videos about how to grow on TikTok, and a lot of it's nonsense. What really matters is what I just said, creating videos that people will watch. Watch time, that's what matters. If people will watch it, if you had no description, it would still do really well. So make sure you focus your efforts on making better videos, not researching the perfect hashtags and doing all these like hidden sneaky things that people will tell you to do that barely matter at all or not at all. Next, you wanna edit the cover. So we're just going to find our favorite angle of this. And I kind of like that angle right there. Maybe zoom in a little bit and I'm gonna hit save. And then here's one of those like magic tricks people say to use. I do it, doesn't matter, but it takes a millisecond. Add United States as location, boop. Then you click add link and you click on product and you go down to the product, which is these Halar leggings. You can change the words there if you want or just leave them, boom. And now you're ready to post this video. So I am right now, it's January 9, 2024 at 7.58 PM. I'm gonna post this video live right now. Will it go viral? Probably not, but it's got a chance because I used a formula that has worked. I didn't do it exactly the same because there was no reveal at the end. But let's do this. We hit post, bam, and the video is live. Then use that for the other videos. And go watch a video on TikTok at Trevor Jones Creator. And if you want to see how to make super cool stuff with just a couple clicks using CapCut's insane templates, you want to click on this video right, right here.